He's got something else coming from the kids. And I can't really say what it is because it's supposed to be a surprise for him. I just heard about it and I'm not exactly sure I know what it is. <laughs> like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here <laughs> This was Joe's little fun gift. His big one. <laughs> it's too big to even begin to show you. It's a huge shelving unit for the garage. Get some of that stuff sorted out. The rubber band gun. Yep, it's a rubber band gun. I'm gonna let him get it loaded. And then he's gonna fire it. We we had a contest earlier today. I kept losing. I won once. Yesterday, last night. Yesterday. Sorry, last night. Okay, it's been one of those days. Christmas kind of got me mixed up. He's been, it's been Saturday for four days. <laughs> He's had the last four days off. Retirement, when he retires, is really going to be confusing. <laughs> Won't it? Uh-huh. That's a, that's a big answer out of him. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay, we're going to try... Ready? Yep, I'm ready. Go ahead and shoot. He's shooting in that little box. That's it. Ten of them. Ten of them. Now we'll see it. let him count, see how many he got. Oh. It all bounced out. I only got three in the box. Uh-oh. It's, you missed the corner? Yeah. <laughs> we figured out that for this box, the best way to keep them from bouncing them out is to hit it in a corner so that it bounces around inside of the box. So, he got three in. That was a good try, dear. He's got something else coming from the kids. And I can't really say what it is because it's supposed to be a surprise for him. I just heard about it, and I'm not exactly sure I know what it is. <laughs> okay, now, I'm just, it's just a Christmas booty type of show. What we got for Christmas. <laughs> okay. Joe got me this Merry Christmas. Oh, what does it say to yeah, it just says Merry Christmas shirt. Which, I wore Christmas Day, and I will probably, I just put it on, he brought it up out of the laundry, so I'm gonna probably hang it on a hanger and hold on to it for next Christmas. It's very pretty, but I'll be more able to wear it for a couple weeks longer next year. Well, not all the time. Another thing he got, he got us a trail cam. Of course, we don't live out in the woods, but we're going to put it on the house. And watch what we find. I got to figure, figure it out yet, but it takes eight batteries. They go in here. Well, you can't really see it. Not without a flashlight or there. Tip it a little bit. You can see the little holes. Holes there where it goes. And then there's a spot here for the yeah, close the battery casing, and there's a slot here for the memory card, and this just locks shut. So hopefully I can catch some of those squirrels and maybe some birds and some bunny rabbits and night, who knows what's out there. Haven't had any smell, but you know, scouts. We don't generally disturb them at night either. So he got. He also got me some memory cards and and the batteries to go with it. And he got me another one of these big honking, um, one of these big honking stainless steel thermos type things. 
I use these. I've got two that I've been switching back and forth. My pink one, it's a Bubba. I don't know if that's the brand. I think it's the brand. This one is Tall. T-A-L. And I'm not sure what my other one is. It might be the same as this one. They're very similar. But it's they're great to have when you're thirsty all the time. My meds keep my mouth so dry. And talking just makes it dry. <laughs> I love to talk. You would have never guessed, huh? And aren't these fancy? He got me some new reading and um, they're they're for reading, they're for computer, because they got that ultra, they've got that blue light screen, and they've also got some UV protection, so they're kind of a little bit of sunglasses, too. Who knew? No. <laughs> Our kids take their turns about who they're going to get for and what they're going to get. My daughter, I love her. My, my youngest daughter did mine, and she got me this big old nice wash basin. I love this thing. I am, I, I, part of me wanted to hang it up on a, you know, like on a wall in the kitchen or maybe a, but I really think what I want to do is get an artificial plant and some rock and I'm trying to take the tag off. <laughs> For some reason I decided to do that. I guess because maybe it won't look, won't look so new that way. <laughs> It, it really has that old style of texture and stuff to it. But I'm going to, I want to get one of those big kind of almost tree-like plants, artificial plants, and then put some rock around it, like maybe some white rock or something like that around it and just, and I'll have to put it, <laughs> find where I want to put it first and leave it set there. But isn't that huge? She lined this thing with a couple sheets of tissue paper. And inside there she put, well, she put something in there. Which, I mean, she she got us all kinds of candy and stuff. But she knows I like, now we do still watch DVDs. I'm sorry, we're old. <laughs> we, we still do watch the digital as well. But I love Star Trek. And this is the new Star Trek, which I love that too. So she got me that and this big old tub. <laughs> and I am going to love putting a... I want an artificial plant because I don't want to have to shove it over in, in the windowsill. Because I don't have that much room in windowsills. So I'm going to have to decide where I want to put it. And... I may not fill the whole thing, you know, like around the plant with rock because that might get kind of heavy. I might put some old fabric or something in there and then set the rock on top a layer or two. But right now I'm leaving it sit back there and letting it decorate. So that has really been a great Christmas. I mean, I not, can't knock that. And Joe showed you what I got him. That was, we've had so much fun with that yesterday. He, we, he'd shoot it, then I'd shoot it, and a couple times he would get, you know, like eight or nine in there. I got nine in once that stayed in. They hit, but then they bounce out, and the thing is to try and get them to stay in there. And so we discovered if you shoot toward one of the upper corners, it'll bounce kind of zigzag, and it'll end up staying where it, staying in the box. But we don't always hit that right. <laughs> I mean, he can do it one hand. I shave too much. I have to use two. So, we're shooters now. <laughs> we are violent with the rubber band gun. Tough it if you don't like it. <laughs> anyway, this is what I have left over from the little... Because, well, I, I made a... Never mind. It's not that important. This one probably fit a newborn or a doll. 
this was an extra of the one to three, but I had made it for my youngest granddaughter, who's not a year yet, but I thought this would be, I mean, she wouldn't wear this long at all. So I managed to make another one that turned out to be kind of in between the two, because this wasn't a newborn size, according to the chart, but I made it, and it's just a little bit different. Just, well, you can see the difference between these two in size. Just about an inch on each side, and the other has maybe got half an inch. So, the one that I gave her. <laughs> I got a lot of thank yous for the hats. They absolutely loved them. My, my youngest no, not okay. My oldest daughter's youngest is a girl. I've got so many granddaughters, I go again. <laughs> but she's just into her teens, and she didn't. She doesn't really care for pink. I mean, she's she's kind of like I used to be, just not a girly girl type. And so, but she really liked it, and she sent me. Her mom took a picture of her. And she just posed in that thing, and, and they sent it to me on Facebook. And I was just, that just made me happy. <laughs> I guess that's it until tomorrow. I'm kind of worn out, and I decided, well, I went and I cleaned out, I did clean out the craft room, so that, or my craft area, so that I probably will work in there again tomorrow. I think we're going to get back on those plates and see if we can't get that set made by the end of this week. Or maybe early this week. Let's see what we can get out of it. And I can still take some suggestions. I think I'm going to fire, fire, that sounds like ceramics, it's so professional. I think I'm going to bake a few tomorrow of, you know, just the blank. And then I'll probably do several different colors and then maybe get some suggestions from you guys on what color of birds to make to go on them. So I might do a yellow plate and I don't have a pink plate. I don't know whether to do a white plate or not, but I've got four more days of the week to do. Okay, we'll see you tomorrow. Behave yourselves. I love you all. Smile and wave and wish somebody a happy new year. It's 2020 will be over and we'll, 2020 will be its own year. We'll see what that ends up being. Love you all. Good night.